Hello again, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the show at night. Here he is, you know him, you love him, your host and star, Josh Beckish! Josh, 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 to the show at night. I am, uh, of course, your host, Josh, and right here to my right is, uh, as always, Byron. Byron, how's it going? Hello, oh, very well. Thank you for asking. How are you? I'm good. Yes, it's nice to well. be here again. Nice to be here. Yeah. So, uh, since the last time we saw you, the internet is a buzz with um, this uh, everything leading the into big this match. Basketball. The big match that's coming up is, is, is getting a lot of attention. A lot of uh, a lot of energy around it. Yeah. yeah. Um, you know, all the uh, Nick fans online are coming at us. Yeah. You know, our loyal army, uh, our Josh Pitt, Josh is, Pitt uh, is firing is back. Absolutely. But there's been a lot of talk the about it. The two different camps are really starting to get heated. There's a lot of heat. There's a lot of uh, blood boiling yes. amongst uh, yeah. all, all parties involved. I mean, there's a lot on the line. It's been on, you know, every major sports news network's been talking about it. There's all the talking heads are, are clamoring about it's everywhere. it. Everywhere. Yeah. Articles galore. I mean, it's all over the internet. It's all anyone's talking about. Um, and it is coming soon. We're locking down a date. Hopefully, uh, the next episode we will release will be the big reveal of when this will all take place. Targeting late June. Targeting late June. Due to uh, vacations and other... Uh, there's, a lot of, yeah, there's a lot of moving parts when you're talking about right. something this big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, um, I didn't want to go into this whole match cold. Well, the build-up has really uh, forced you to take this maybe more seriously than you thought you needed to. Yeah, the intensity that was coming out of Nick in that interview was uh, not something that went unnoticed. And uh, I felt as though maybe I slightly underestimated him. Perhaps. We'll um, see. You know, uh, to my own fault. You know, never go into a situation like this assuming you're going to win. You have to go in, uh, you know, knowing that you're going to have to scratch and claw for every. You would rather be over prepared than under prepared. Exactly. And that's where I stepped in and thought I would offer uh, my guidance and a little bit of direction and some suggestions to you yeah. as a friend and a coach and. and, and Someone who just cares about your overall well-being and uh, wanted to kind of get you in a position to win. It was a real eye-opener. I dug into uh, depths of my athletic ability that I didn't know were there. And uh, yeah, my, my eyes were opened. I was just, uh, something inside me was awakened. And uh, you know, I, why don't we just show? Them? Yeah, instead of just trying to explain it to you, why don't we uh, just go to the footage and let you guys see what the training process has been like so far. I'm going to turn you in to a court baller of epic status. Are you ready? Sure. It is time for you to combine your mind, your spirit, your body, your essence, the true being of a champion. Watch your step. Are you ready for that? Yes. Can you do it? Yes, Will let's you go. Listen Not ready. No. Oh. Tap into the spirit of a
but your spiritual being. Spirit of an athlete, essence of a champion. You are close, my son. You are close to achieving the spirit of an athlete and having the true essence of a champion. I think I'm almost ready to beat you, Nick. You are on the right path. You know what I think I need. What do you need? I think I need one more shot. From here? That's impossible. Even the best athletes of all time. Nothing's impossible. He is ready. He is ready! Nice. All right, see you, hey, man. Well, thanks. Adios. Thanks for the help. Have a good see day. you later. Man. Ow! Well, I mean, I mean, that was invigorating just to see it again. I had forgotten how intense it really was. Yeah, I mean, you know, let anybody uh, think, lest anybody thinks that we are taking this anywhere no. near, uh, you know, not seriously. This is not a lighthearted situation. No, 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 no. We're no. fully invested in victory. Yeah, and I mean, there were parts of that that weren't even included because they were so intense, it just, like... We don't think the viewership could have handled it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There was things that uh, right. nobody should ever see. But, right. so, yeah, so that is, uh, that's been what's going on with that so that's far. That's what we're doing. Stay tuned. Uh, hopefully, like I said, hopefully next episode, official date, lockdown, ready to go by then. Um, and yeah. then We'll see what ends up happening. But have, yeah, 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 yeah. This is this is even better. The big I, mean, I was excited was about that, but I'm really excited about this. Yeah, one of the things we were excited about coming back and starting the live studio experience was uh, being able to actually have our guests on. As fun as it was having interviews and stuff over Zoom. Uh, Zoom a, shroom. Right. So that that's so 2020. There's a whole different dynamic when you're in the same facility when you're. When you're around each other and you can just kind of bounce off without any delays or bad connections or unfortunate background photo pictures um, you know all those things but we are excited to have our first ever live in-studio guest who is a returning guest returning and guest a friend of the show early on in the series you might have uh, you may remember this guest we had uh, he 
but he had everybody on the floor laughing with his stand-up routine and uh, dare I say, down routine. Dare I say, uh, brought tears to the eyes of our viewers with his uh, with his monologue selections and uh, performances. But coming up right after this, Cage Volta slash Jerry, Jerry Lewis, Lewis Jr. Jr. slash Sammy Davis Jr. Sammy the Davis third. Jr. Jr. slash DJ Spanky. Slash Keach and Tear coming up on the show right after this. We see why George Lopez got his shit canceled. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, here it is, our first ever this live. Is so in exciting! Studio. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to welcome to the show, back to the show, Keach and Tear. Good to see you. Go on, sit down. Man, good to see you. Please, please have a seat right there, right there. Make yourself comfortable. All right. Well, there you go, sir. There's the mug. I know you wanted one of those. The guest I'm mug. Here. I don't know if we can legally show that. Well, Keetrin, welcome back to the show. How's it going, man? How you been? I think we're doing all right, Josh. How are you? I mean, uh, you know, obviously we're doing all right here. We're finally back live. Uh, you know, the last time we had you on, it was over the internet on Zoom. But uh, and yeah, a lot's happened uh, since then and now. What's what's going on? A lot of things, Josh. Tell you, tell you, tell you about a lot of things been going on lately. You know, been working, still, movie shooting, movie shooting, pandemic. Accidents, you know, just trying to stay above water. I hear you, man. Now, uh, I know the last time you were here, you know, you did your stand up routine and you did some monologues from some very famous movies. I think perhaps those helped propel you to uh, where you're at now and, uh, you know, brought you into the eyes of a lot of new people. And you've got, uh, off the back of that, you have a new project coming out. Tell us all about it. It's the movie called Price You Pay. Mm. So I played a detective looking for my cousin boyfriend and been, they've been through a toxic relationship. You know, mm -hmm. so she called me, asked me, hey, I need you to find this car from Can You Use Can You Look It Up? No problem. I did that. So I you know, shot everybody in that production company. They did very well. It comes out June 7th. June 7th, June 7th. right around the corner. We're all very excited for it. Um, well, on what platform where will it be available? YouTube, Facebook. How does it feel going from, uh, you know, kind of just like, a back, not a background player, but a, a co-star to like, you know, one of the big stars of the film. I feel wonderful. I work really hard for this. I really appreciate it, you know what I'm saying? I think we should have been included in the film, but, um, you know, everybody has their own thing. Yeah, it's, and, it's, uh, it's a color film. Uh, wait a second. <laughs> what kind of film is it? Oh, it's a color film. You oh, know? it's in color? Yeah, yeah. Well, Perfect. Yeah, you want sticking, to sticking with today's standards. Yes, yes. It's a romantic in the beginning. You just have to watch and see. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. I mean, and watch so. And see. I don't want to get too many details out, but hey, I feel like I can be with the big dogs. Lawrence Fishburne. There's always some wacky stuff that goes on behind the scenes. Like, any any, any inside stuff for us there? You gotta watch it and see, my man. Okay. So uh, the who, parts who, that happen off you? camera are gonna be in the movie. The who? The, the moments that happen off camera will also yeah. be in the movie. Okay. It's a mini series. I'm just gonna say it's, it's a mini series. Oh, it's series? a mini series. Yeah, I mini thought it was a short film. Mini series, short film, same thing. Oh, okay. short. Now, another thing that happened since the last time we saw you, you were the victim of a victim of an unfortunate uh, hit and run accident. What was oh that no! Oh man. Yes, yes. It was the first. Time. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. And I'm just, I'm just cruising as I look up in a rear view, a car just flying up the street. Oh. So I'm trying to move, move over to the left a little bit. Just came up, smacked me right in the corner. Mm. Yes, yes. Clipped you. Yeah, clipped me. It was hard. Ping pong between two trees. Mm. Oh! 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 Spent out. Like bam bam. Spent out. The truck spent over into another field, then he sped off. So but he walked away from that unharmed for the most part. Yeah. Will you incorporate any of that type of stuff into your stand up routine? No. You know, a lot of the comedians deal with personal issues by putting it into their routine. Will right. that be included? Trauma turned into humor. Mm, probably so. I probably, probably will still. I'm still shaking up. I mean, yeah, it'd be yeah. great for you to add something to that bit. Have you been contacted by anybody to do any uh, future productions? 
was like a little small part, you know, it's a little cameo. Yeah. Yeah, that's about it, you know. Yeah. That's what you do. You get big and then you get to like go back to the yeah. people that you came up with and yeah. do little bit parts for yeah, them. Yeah, bit parts, you know, show some love. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, you should know, you know. Absolutely. Showing you love, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And anyway, we are the lucky ones here. Tell us about this lady friend you met. Oh yeah, are you? Yeah, what's yeah? What's going on with you? Uh, you know, personally, are you, any any budding romances? Any relationship statuses yeah. changing soon? Yeah, I'm in a relationship. I mean, I'm very happy. Oh. I'm happy. She's she's a wonderful person. Very wonderful. Aww. Well, I'm glad to see yeah, that yeah, things wonderful. things have really uh things have really blossomed for you. Yeah, yeah. Maybe here. she 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 makes me grow even more. Oh, yeah, oh, 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 Eventually uh, get married. Apparently, this is a serious relationship. Yeah, very seriously, you know. Um. Well, hey, I'm glad to hear everything's worked out. I'm glad to hear things are going well. And uh, yeah, everybody, make sure to go see um, the price you pay coming out June seventh. Available on uh, multiple platforms. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. And where, where, how do you, uh, where would people find that? Just check out the price you pay. Is it yeah, under the introduction just company? Hashtag price you pay, and then it'll be right there to film. Well, I can't yeah. wait to see it. I can't. We'll, uh, we'll have to do a full review of the, uh, Absolutely. Of the uh, project, and uh, yeah, we'll bring it up when, uh, when we come back. I'd hate to miss out on this opportunity. I was gonna wrap the interview up, but can you give us just a little, any new stand-up material you have? Is there anything you can do for our viewers? I make a napkin dance. Put a little boogie in it. <laughs> so they got a new burger at yeah. McDonald's. It's the Michael Jackson burger. Oh. You know what it's made of? 40 year old meat between two 12 year old buns. <laughs> that's that's kind of. Yeah, yeah. It's that. a pretty relevant joke. Yeah. <laughs> Once again, Keatron here. Uh, thanks for stopping by. It was wonderful to see you. It was great to have you. It's been a pleasure. It was great to have you. Kate Travolta. Yeah. And uh, thank you all for watching <laughs> that. Great. And uh, thanks. we'll see you guys next time. Uh, yeah, and hopefully with more information on the basketball game. And uh, who knows what's around the corner for us. But uh, for Byron, for Keatron, uh, for myself, Josh, as we always say on this show, Bye! Bye.